I'm going to show you how to place a hold in OverDrive. All right, so if you are looking through our site and you have found a book that says waitlist and you wanna place your name on the list to get it, you're going to click on the book that you want and you're gonna click place a hold. And this is where you're going to add your email address. And then you're going to confirm your email address to make sure you typed it in correctly both times. And then you're going to click place hold. And then it's going to tell you if it was successful and it's going to tell you what your position is. So right now I'm number two, there's one copy. It's going to tell me what email address I've told it to send it to. And then it gives me some other suggestions. Now I can go to manage your holds. The other way to get to that would be to go to my account and click on holds. All right, so as you can see, I now have two items on hold. One has a wait time of four weeks, one has a wait time of two weeks. So I'm first on the list for one, second on the list for others, and it tells me when I place the items on hold. Now I can edit the email that I put in for the hold, so say I no longer use that email and need to change it. I can suspend the hold. So say I want this book, but I'm reading a couple of other books and I don't want it quite yet. I can tell it how long I want to suspend it for. So say I want to read it, but maybe in two months instead. I can click suspend. So instead it'll wait until November 1st to pull the book for me if it's available or I'll have it hopefully ready sometime after that point for me. I can also remove the hold. So say I've decided I don't want this hold any longer. I can click on remove. It'll confirm it that I want to remove the hold. And now that title is no longer on hold for me. All right, and that is how you place a hold on OverDrive.